What's going on everybody? Arjo Choi here from SB Nation's bloggingtheboys.com and welcome to BTB's continued coverage of the 2020 NFL Draft. You know, we talked after the first round when the Cowboys took Oklahoma wide receiver C.D. Lamb with the 17th overall pick about how that was the best player available. That was the move the Cowboys made and sticking to their board. Objectivity is your best friend when it comes to an exercise like the NFL Draft. And in the second round, a lot of people anticipated that the team would finally address the defensive side of the ball. And you had to imagine that things were gonna line up for that to happen. And ultimately they did. With the 51st overall selection in the 2020 NFL Draft, the Dallas Cowboys did indeed go defense, taking Alabama cornerback Travon Diggs. Now everybody knows the Cowboys lost Byron Jones in free agency to the Miami Dolphins, and so they were drastically in need of improving their secondary. They need help at both corner and safety. We know they brought in Ha Ha Clinton Dix in free agency, another Alabama product. We know they brought in Maurice Kennedy and Savion Smith, another Alabama product in terms of cornerback, but the Cowboys still needed to add more. We know that they have Jordan Lewis and Chidabe Wuze entering contract years. We know that the Cowboys did bring back Anthony Brown, but they still needed talent. Trevon Diggs is a long, tall, athletic cornerback Kind of has some a little bit of a safety feel to his game, but he is somebody that is really going to help this Cowboys secondary for a long time. And you think about what the Cowboys have been needing. They've been needing those longer bodies. We know that Chris Richard kind of tried to dabble in different things during his time as the secondary coach and passing game coordinator and pseudo defensive coordinator and whatnot, but that didn't exactly work out. Trevon Diggs, if you didn't know, the younger brother of Stephon Diggs, the Buffalo Bills wide receiver, is somebody who comes from Alabama, knows what it's like to play big time football games, knows what it's like to cover big time products, knows how to go up against elite wide receiver talent. He did it all the time in the SEC where it just means more. Trevon Diggs is an excellent pick for the Dallas Cowboys with the 51st overall pick and a huge way that they have now improved their secondary in addition to their passing game. And you look at it, the Cowboys, they have done such a great job of not only sticking to their board, but of getting insane value. The Cowboys held the 17th overall pick and the 51st overall picks, and they've gotten players that were ranked very highly by a lot of NFL draft experts. A lot of people believe that CeeDee Lamb is the best wide receiver that was available in the class, and a lot of people had Diggs as the third or the fourth best cornerback, so for the Cowboys to get somebody of that quality without having to trade up all the way down to the 51st overall pick is a testament to their patience and their discipline to stick to the plan. It's a job absolutely well done by Mike McCarthy, Jerry Jones, Stephen Jones, and Will McClay, and one that we are admiring a whole lot over at Blogging the Boys. So make sure you check out bloggingtheboys.com where we'll have in-depth discussions and breakdowns of everything going on with the 2020 Dallas Cowboys draft class. Subscribe right here to the official Blogging the Boys YouTube channel where we'll have some film reviews up soon. Make sure to follow us on social media at Blogging the Boys on Twitter at bloggingthe.boys on the gram. You can get me on Twitter and Instagram at rjochoa. And while you're at it, make sure you subscribe to the Blog of the Boys podcast. We're having all sorts of conversations discussing all of the Cowboys draft picks, and we want you to be a part of it. Have a fantastic day. We'll see you soon enough.